When it comes to cinematography and video production, there is one thing that a lot of us as filmmakers and cinematographers and even just content creators tend to leave out and tend to forget a lot of the time. And that thing, that very, very important thing is lighting. Lighting is one of the three fundamentals in my opinion when it comes to a great looking video and a great video in general, whether it be for documentary purposes or work you're doing for a client or just even a project that you're doing for yourself. And those three fundamental things to me are story, sound and lighting. And your story can be good and if your sound and your lighting are terrible, the video won't have the best impact that it could have. And your lighting can be good, but your sound can be subpar and your story can just not be present. And I think that knowing how to do good lighting or learning how to light things well is a very, very important skill when it comes to leveling up your work or leveling up yourself as a cinematographer, videographer, content creator, video producer. Also, if you enjoyed this video so far, please, please, please do not forget to subscribe, like this video, and just leave your thoughts down in the comments below. Do you agree with what I'm saying? Do you think that it is important? Because I do really think the lighting is very, very important. Now, one thing a lot of people may not always have access to great lighting equipment or the best lighting tools, but one thing that you can do is practice early on with natural lighting and go out, explore, and see what looks best, see what angles looks best, what time of day looks best to you, and see what works best for you. And that is a very free and easy way to learn how to light things and learn what looks well and what would work the best for you. And especially nowadays, there's a lot of hype around this camera or that camera, getting a specific camera for your use cases. And I think a lot of the time, although the cameras, the cameras are great, cameras right now are so, so amazing. But if the lighting is subpar and if your production in general is subpar, things won't look great. And um, somebody always likes to go out and shoot in natural lighting and get some amazing shots because you know where to position yourself, you know where to position yourself according to the sun. And even some simple things like having just a little bit of diffusion when you're out in the sun, having a diffuser or even having a white cloth to diffuse the light. If you can't afford a diffuser, those things make a really big difference and help shots go a very very long way so even if you have a great camera even if you have an amazing lens sometimes having bad lighting and bad sound takes away completely from what you're doing to set up your camera and even having the great camera that you do happen to have so when it comes to a good looking shot lighting is very very important to know what you are doing and what would look best and what would look would work best and one of the things that you could do is you could go online look at behind the scenes of big productions movies films short films um, even commercials documentaries and see how they like the shots look at the shots in the documentary in the videos and look at how they like the shots look at the behind the scenes of how they do what they do and see what you can learn from that and go out and practice because actually going out and doing things practically for yourself is a very very big way to learn what works best and what looks best and what looks cinematic.